This is the video review for Transformers, Revenge of the Fallen, Voyager Class, Jungle Attack, Ironhide. Uh, in my opinion, this new Ironhide is what a weapons specialist should be like, full of weapons. I like his new paint job, the silver on him, silver zebra lines or whatever you want to call them. They look really electric, they make them look alive, really cool. And he's just got loads of weapons that snap on, snap off. You can you can stick them around almost anywhere. He's got tons of little places here, 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 here. Uh, so the general places where you can snap on the weapons. See the guns will fit on the bottom. You can move them out. They're they're attached onto little hooks that are actually on ball joints and then put into the gun. So they're really really movable. Uh, they do come off also. You can take the hook off the knife and you just have a knife. So really cool how they did this with the weapons. And again they can just snap on, snap off so many different ways. I'll take the weapons off for now just kind of lay them out down there so he is um, a remold of the original Revenge of the Fallen and 07 movie line Ironhide he has had a new bumper and a new top and actually I have this one here that has the unpainted uh, prototype parts here you can see that the, the bumper was unpainted it's new, folds up. The windshield, the top here, back, sides, and these sides are actually new too. Uh, they are also unpainted, but they're in black plastic instead of gray. A little bit hard to notice. And I think that's about it. But it gives you a good idea of what is new on the iron hut. Otherwise, he is the same mold. Uh, here's the other Revenge of the Fallen, Voyager class Ironhide. I'll take the weapon off of him also, so we can just take a quick comparison look here. You'll see the lights and the bars that have been added. Carriage on the back and the mega huge bumper on the front. Otherwise, same tires and the same truck overall. They still have the same holes in the back here, so you can put this gun onto him without any problem it'll fit and then you can snap on all the rest of his weapons and he's really weapon specialist iron hide so a really cool looking alt mode i think this is definitely my favorite iron hide out of them all you can see here even the arm weapons which he does have uh, they're smaller and they kind of hide underneath a lot better than the other ones did this all out. So that's his alt mode. You can see he's got some blue painted, uh, supposed to be glass for the front window. Black plastic, plastic with a little bit of detailing in silver. And some white beige uh, plastic. That's about it. The weapons are done in a brownish color, dark brown. And again with the white beige on there. So I think it's nice, attractive mold. We can transform them. Uh, to transform them, I don't really follow maybe the instructions or anything like that. I'll rip the arms out, separate them, and then I'll kind of separate the legs a little bit, loosen off these side panels here, which then I can break off this piece, and that'll flip the torso down. Oh, this bumper comes right off, so we just take that off. These pieces will come up and out which will let the arms kind of flip up like this. Once I got the arms up, I'll rotate the torso around 180 degrees, just like that. Push the wheels in and move the arms around. Okay, so I get the head up and then I'll snap the wheels in to hold the head into place. Uh, his back 
kind of fold together like that and fit into place here. His hips will come together like this and snap into place twice. His feet have the auto morph on it. Pull down that, opens up his leg. His chest piece opens up and pushes back into his face. And one nice thing about this guy is that he doesn't have the doors that flap in. So that's it on top. No bulk. All the bulk is on his back though. And I'm guessing that's how it goes. I really don't know. But it seems to form a nice pack. And you can kind of put the weapons on there, however you may. So I'll just fix up his hands. Straighten his face a little. And I actually like this face. I think he really looks like a cat, uh, in my opinion. And I think this face is really cool. Nice painting with the silver. I think it looks a lot better than the original Revenge of the Fallen Ironhide. So there you see him in robot mode. I think the colors look great. I love the silver, I love the silver on the legs. Definitely think this is the best looking alt mode and bot mode of Ironhide. Now of course he's got the awesome weapon selection that just can't be beat. And he's got a rocket launcher here, which is actually really a crossbow. And this piece opens up and fits kind of right into there. It doesn't really fit the best, but it does fit in there and does form a crossbow. Just like that. Now his guns can of course go in his hands. Uh, you could pop one in the bottom, one on the top if you wanted to. Same with the knives, they could also go in either which way. And go in the other hand too. Uh, his additional weapons, if you're not using them at all times, they could snap on the bottom here, they could snap on the top here. I'll stick, I like to stick the guns on the back like that. And then I'll kind of stick the knives going down like that. It looks more like he's got a knife at his hip like a sword. And a gun on his back, of course. And that's how I like to transform my jungle attack iron hide. We can compare him to premium class iron hide from the 07 line. And I really think the silver just looks that much better, that much more realistic. The head's better overall. This new jungle iron hide's a much better representation, I think. It looks way better. I'd much rather have this one than this one, so bye-bye. Uh, the crossbow is really cool, and I think he's just got a lot of really cool weapons. Uh, if I'm playing with him as a kid, this guy gives me a lot of choice. So the crossbow does fall out easy. I'm not sure if it snaps in uh, better, but seems to be about the best it goes. It seems to kind of snap in, so it does hold in a place. As you see, it's not just falling out, but at the same time, if you knock it, it'll come right out. See? Oh. We got to snap it in there like that. So that's Revenge of the Fallen, Voyager class, Jungle, Attack, Ironhide.